Hello guys, this is Darren from the Variety Show Uncut, yes, we're here again today, alright, looks like it's finally coming on, got to uh, get rid of something here. Hey Tyrone, hey Stream Bean, Dana, how's it going, Michael? Sorry, I was just trying to get some uh, stuff fixed on the stream there, so need to look a little better. Do apologize. So, how's everybody doing? How's everybody doing? All right, let's just go ahead and get right into it because I don't want to be on very long tonight. Uh, I got a few pops that I just wanted to show off and everything before uh, that I gotten a few weeks ago, probably probably a few weeks ago. Let me try to get them over here where I can reach them and stuff. Couple little things. Get them over here closer to me. But I've been busy and I hadn't been live in probably two or three weeks. Well, since the new car giveaway, anyway. <laughs> so, uh. <laughs> Stream Bean says, whatever I do, do not send him any more hot sauce. Guys, go check out his video where he tried to drink that stuff. That's I, I tried to warn him that it was hot, and he still wanted me to send it with it to him anyway. He said it wasn't hot, but it was. <laughs> and thank you for asking, Michael. But I know he said that he was done with food challenges, but uh, he don't have to be done with food cha challenges. Just don't do anything hot, Stream Bing. When somebody tells you it's hot, don't do it. <laughs> uh, I'm doing all right, SDA. How's it going? So, but, uh, Tyrone's in the house. Michael, how's it going? I do have about four more things for past prizes that I got to send out. Been extremely busy, hadn't done that yet, but uh, they'll be out soon. I know uh, Candyman's got one, and Peanut Butter, and Michael Bolt, and Angelica, where the, I'm an invader. Hey, Darren Ryback does food challenges on his channel. Awesome, I have to check it out. I have to check it out, uh, but uh, anyways, like I said, I've had these things for a little while, I just hadn't, they've been in my car for probably for a month or so, but the last Target Con, I picked this guy up right here, pretty cool, I know the lighting's not it's great, but it's kind of it looks kind of dark. But uh, Jim Henson ho holding uh, Ernie. Um, Ernie was actually, I think, from what I've read, 
was uh, his first creation of, of puppets, which is pretty cool. String band. I want to try the new Burger King Impossible Double Whopper that Ryback ate. Bean, stay away from hot stuff. Um, so yeah, I got some other stuff here. I actually went in, I actually got these uh, about a week ago. I went into my Walmart and they had two of these out. So I picked them up. I did, uh, Ride back TV. I'll have to check that out. But uh, guys, don't don't forget to hit the like button. See, I only have two likes. Looks like six or seven of y'all in here. But they had these guys in in my Walmart after they told me that they had recalled them and took them off the shelf. Uh, these are okay condition. A little crushed spot right there, but uh, this is the Lantern Hofstadter as Green Lantern from the uh, Big Bang Theory. And I know they had a bunch of them. One day, I went back about two hours later and they was all gone. Uh, I asked them where they moved them to. They said they had took them to the back because they had been recalled. <laughs> let's see it's called Rabbi TV I have to check it out WWE Rhonda has a YouTube channel awesome stream and then this is the other one from the Big Bang Theory they just had and this was like a couple of days ago after they had a bunch of them then none and now they put two out so I'm going to keep checking back maybe they'll have the other ones out eventually this is Penny as Wonder Woman, Big Bang Theory. Awesome, awesome, cool looking pop right there. So, but uh, some of y'all may know, and some of y'all probably don't, because about two videos ago I announced that I was going to do be doing a 400 subscriber giveaway. Yeah, I know that's what y'all's here for. More details on that coming later. Coming later. Also, put this over here. Get rid of these bags. See what this one is. Next one. Like I said, these all been in my car for a while. Okay, I remember this one. I actually got this one, I think, last week as well. I have no idea, Michael. I think that it was just something they made up. So, but anyways, this is one that I got. Actually, I think I got it last weekend. And it was only $5 at GameStop. So I went ahead and picked it up because I like this movie. And it is a Greta from Gremlins. They had like three or four of these for five dollars. Man, that's a good price on those, I thought. But uh, Greta from the Gremlins. There's only one other one in this line, this series. So, right there. Flashing Gremlin. I'd like to get that one. But we'll have to wait. And see if I can find it on sale somewhere sometime. What's up, Cosmo? What's going on? These are here. I probably got these about a month ago. These next ones. And I actually got these at a GameStop, too. I had to get this one because I like the movie as well. Yeah, I like to get the Gizmo one too, Michael. But I had to get this one because I like the movie. This is the only one I could find. I wasn't able to find the other one in this set. But uh, Chuck Nolan. 
from Castaway, uh, Tom Hanks' character. This was a pretty good one. This was the one with him holding Wilson, which I thought was pretty cool. And he's holding uh, his spear. I don't know if you can see it right there, but the spear's got a fish on it. That's pretty cool. Thought I'd get that one out and show it. <coughs> you have an OG Gizmo plush. That's cool. I'd like to see that one. And, uh, there's, I know there's some bigger channels on live right now, and I'm glad that you, the four that is watching is here, so thank y'all for uh, stopping in. Also, I like this movie, and this is another Tom Hanks movie, and I had to get this one. And I'd like to get the uh, other one to this set, too, but I couldn't find it either. But this is Tom Hanks' character, Jimmy, in A League of Their Own. Which is a pretty cool one. And as you can see on the back, they have Dottie as well. Which was the other main character of the movie, which I kind of like to get that one. You have the Gizmo Pops. <laughs> Michael Boat, we need variety. Yes, we do. We need variety. Though, I was going to do a spray paint live earlier today, and I was going to do it through StreamYard, and, but StreamYard will not allow you to host from your phone. So, and my webcam on my laptop is all messed up, jacked up, and everything. Doesn't work, um, but hopefully uh, we'll get a webcam soon and get that going. So I could actually host and maybe even invite other channels to come on with me and everything. So we're trying to figure it out. Hopefully we get there soon. So string bean, I need that pop. Is it expensive string? Uh, SDA, there's no crying in baseball. That's right, there's no crying in baseball. I also got this one on the same day that I got the Castaway in the League of Their Own popping, and this is a cool one right here. The Batman Red Rain Batman. Turn it there so you don't have much of a glare, so y'all can see it a little bit better. These black boxes, I like these black boxes with the gold writing on them. And it's kind of, you could, I can't think of the word for it, but it's a raised lettering and everything. That's pretty cool. But there it is. The artwork on the back is awesome and also on the side. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. And then the last pop, this was from, uh, not this past Target days, but the one before. And this is the biggest one. I'm a big, <laughs> I'm a big history buff. And I had to have this, even though it was 30 bucks. That is the uh, George Washington crossing the Delaware Number 11, History Pop. This guy is pretty cool, isn't it? And I may do a video on this one later on. And, uh, take it out of the box. Maybe do a little story time or something with it, history-wise. But this is this is a cool one, up close. So we'll have to take it out of the box at a later date and do a video, a separate video on that. Want to get one? They did those boxes very well. Yes, they did. 
Michael is still eleven dollars on the Amazon website where I bought it at. What which one are you talking about, Bean? Thanks for the info. It's a heavy pop. Hey uh, hey Avery, how's it going? How's it how you doing? <coughs> I'm doing okay. Now next item I want to show these are non Funko items but I had to pick these up because I thought they was cool and as you know I started some Hot Wheels stuff I'm gonna show this one later I'll show this one first but the first one Hot Wheels Back to the Future all right, there's the car. <laughs> it is the poop car. You got the poop on it with the guy in the car. I don't know how well y'all can see that. There it is. It's right there. There you go. I had to have that. I thought that was cool. Ford Super Deluxe Premium Hot Wheels. And the other one that I got is pretty awesome too. Batman. Huge Batman fan. There we go. This is the other old Batmobile from uh, the original Batmobile from the classic TV series so uh, and I'm not taking these out of the boxes I'm sorry about the glare on these but this is a pretty sweet Hot Wheels pretty sweet the glare is killing me. There we go. There we go. Need to get that one. <laughs> that is a pretty cool one. I like that one. I picked those up at my local Walmart. Not too long ago, uh, it was like right after I started showing the Hot Wheels on my channel. Is when I picked that one up. And would y'all like to see another uh, 50 case of Hot Wheels being unboxed on here? Let me know if you if you would like to see that. I've been I'm, I'm probably I'm probably going to purchase another one, but. Uh, if y'all would let me know if you would like to see that or not on the channel, we may do that again. But I am going to purchase another one in the near future. Just trying to decide if I want to do it as a video content or not. It is it's quite a bit larger. Uh, SDA. Um, see if it says on here. Anyway, I'm looking. It does. I don't see the scale on the box anywhere. I wish they made these where you could uh, slide them off the card to open them and then, and then you just push them back in so you can get out and get um, get them out and take a better look at them and everything and then uh, and then put them back in. But 
But to answer your question, yeah, it is quite a bit larger than a normal Hot Wheels. Just kind of give you a comparison here. It's right there. So SDA said he would like to see some another unboxing of that. Yeah, it does. Yes, it does, Michael. I mean, I don't, I don't want to keep the channel as one thing. You know, I'm going to a Comic-Con Saturday in Little Rock, and I'm hoping to get some um, decent video down there, but I'm going to meet quite a few uh, actors and a couple of wrestlers, uh, voice actors and stuff like that. I, uh, sometime this week, I need to get my pops ready and uh, put them in pop protectors and everything, get them ready to take down there and get them signed. Which, um, the guy that, uh, plays Chewbacca now, uh, can't think of his name right offhand, but he's gonna be there, and I got a, a Chewbacca pop I'm gonna take down with me. Sean Astin's gonna be down there, um, I'm gonna take my Rudy pop down there to get him. I wish I had his Goonies pop to take, uh, but I don't. Uh, Ric Flair is going to be there. I'm going to definitely take uh, Ric Flair's pop to be signed, autographed. Mick Foley is going to be there. I don't have that pop yet, but Boondock Pop, shout out to Boondock. He's supposed to be uh, getting me one. He said it's probably going to be Thursday before he has it. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping, hoping it comes so I can get that signed. Uh, who else was going to be there? Mm. Trying to think. Trying to think. Trying to think. Who else? Oh, yeah. The voice actor for uh, My Hero Actor, Damia Shada Azawa, or whatever his name is. He is, uh, he's supposed to be there, so I'm going to take that pop, have it autographed, and then probably sell it. Um, but yeah, yeah, I met Mick. The last time I met him has been probably 25 years ago or so, maybe a little longer than that. It's been, it's been a while back, and that is back when I was first getting into wrestling. And uh, and he was a cool dude. I got a picture of him, of me and him together on my Facebook page somewhere on my Facebook page. But uh, and I think maybe I might have posted it, put it on my Instagram at one time. But I was young. I was I was very young back then. I was probably eighteen, nineteen years old. I might have been seventeen. I know I was young when I first met him, and that was the last time I met him, but, uh, would definitely like to see him again, and show him that old picture, I think that would be cool, and, uh, see, met Mick, too, okay, that's awesome, they had a small comic con here in North Carolina, where I live, had a few good people, Yep, that's where the Nature Bowl is from, North Carolina. We met Stone Cold and Steve Austin. Awesome. Yeah, it's been a long time since I saw him last in person. But uh, speaking of which, he's got a new show on USA that comes on after Monday Night Raw that's pretty decent. All right, I showed y'all. told y'all I was going to show you a painting I've done today. This is what I was going to do on YouTube Live earlier today, and uh, <coughs> StreamYards won't let you host a live stream from your phone, so I'm going to have to wait a little bit while, a little while on that before I could do it. But here's the painting that I done. I don't know how well y'all can see that. 
on there but uh just to kind of give y'all what it looks like very glossy so kind of throw it on there but it's got real nice colors to it i like but anyways there's that okay it's showing up pretty good hello kenneth how's it going how's it going kenneth but i'm fixing to uh get off here oh i almost forgot 400 sub giveaway some of y'all may already know that I've started this. Some of y'all probably don't. Because in the video where I announced it, it was at the very end of the video. And, uh, and I said, uh, to hashtag row to 400 on that video and you would uh, be entered to qualify to win for the 400 giveaway and only two people hashtag so I I know two people watched the video the whole way through and uh, that was Wally's World of Toys she had qualified or she had entered to qualify to win the uh, 400 sub giveaway when that happens and the endo nerd hashtagged on that video as well so instead of doing a comment picker for them to or a will of death for them to to get them qualified to win I'm just gonna put them both on there since they were the only two that done that so they are qualified to win the 400 giveaway. I'm writing their names down right now. So they are the first two qualifiers for the uh, 400 sub giveaway. So I wrote those, wrote, wrote those names down. Now, in my next few videos, I'm gonna sneak. I'm gonna put something in there. What you'd hashtag on that video, everything, and we'll go through that. That gives you an entry to qualify for the 400 sub giveaway. So, so be on the lookout in those videos. There's four of y'all watching now, so four more of you will know about this, or whoever whoever else watches. I might make the announcement of it at the end of the video. I might make it in the middle of the video. I might make it at the beginning of the video. But the next live that I do, I will pick somebody from those videos to be qualified for the 400 giveaway when we do that and it's going to be one box <coughs> and then when i do the 400 giveaway it'll be one winner and uh, they will get a pretty good size box let's just say let's just say that they're going to get a pretty good size box and I don't have everything that I'm going to put in the box yet. But I do have one thing that I put in there. And let's see if I can reach up and grab it and show you what the first thing in that box is going to be. I know those of y'all that are watching may not care about this one. But it's a cool looking pop but i never heard of it this show but it is disney and luna 
would be the first prize in that big box. Funko Pop. It is Disney. It's uh, Elena of Avalor or whatever. But uh, Elena of Avalor. So that's going to be the first prize in the 400 subscriber giveaway box. One box. We're going to be qualifying people throughout until we get to that. 400 sub mark uh, a while ago earlier today when I looked I was at 341 I looked right before I come on here I'm back down to 339 so I've lost a couple since uh, before I went live don't know where I lost them at but I lost them but I'm going to set this off to the side that will be one thing that will be going into the prize box for the 400 give away Michael Boat, I hope to have something out. I'm hoping to have your prize win out sometime next two or three weeks. Um, you got a lot of stuff going on and uh, everything, so hopefully it'll be before then. But uh, but I I can't promise you anything. So but yeah, I, I, SDA I've never heard of it either, but it's still. A nice looking, cool looking pot. I got this at Hot Topic and it was on clearance, so I thought that would be a cool giveaway at some point. So, there you go. That's the back of it. There's actually like six pops to that set. Anyways, guys. Um... I'm going to get off here. Thank you for, for sticking with me through the whole thing. And uh, we'll see y'all sometime soon. And be and guys, be on the lookout for when I tell y'all to hashtag something in one of my videos. And uh, oh, before I do go, I'm planning on having a new video show come out. Probably, I'm thinking, hopefully, it'll be starting next Sunday. You know how everybody does a shout uh, Tylock's got a shout out Saturday. Boondog's got uh, Funko Fam Friday. Hey, let's just make a weekend of it. And I'm going to do a Scream Out Sunday. I'm going to call it Scream Out Sunday. So. Guys, if y'all have any suggestions for channels that I can look at and uh, scream out on Sundays, let me know on Instagram. Alright, so let's support one another and be kind to one another. Remember, everybody needs a little variety in their life. Hopefully next live will be more exciting than this one, but thank y'all anyway for coming in. Peace out. We'll see you next time, right here on the Variety Show Uncut. Peace out.